Hey, so today I want to work on the swing arm and do a little work to it. I decided I want to loop this around, connect it at, at the rear, that make it stronger along with the crossbar up here, which I don't know where it's going to go yet. Because I want to redo this one once I put the shock uh, in here and see where I want that to go. Um, and then I'm going to try to get to the seat. I'm not sure. I hope I do, but I don't want to make it too long. So yeah, let me get to that. Okay, so I got this crossbar cut out. I'll probably end up just run a straight one or maybe a slight angle uh, bend in it. But I'm going to get to the back of the foot. I'm going to bend the loop and then I'll see how far I want to stick out. I can trim both pieces. Let's see, but I got these clamped up square with everything. It's all clamped down and square. I'm gonna, this is 17 inches, so I'm going to get a 17 inch.
so I got the swing arm together. Uh, it's square and level and everything. Now I need to work on the shock mount, but I'm going to bend up a basic seat loop shape and see where I want to go with that. It'll probably have a come back and then have a bend up at the back just for looks and it'll match the swing arm too. Okay, so I got the seat loop bent up. I put this rear bend in it and then a slight bend to match this angle. So, and this is about where it's going to go. So it's going to be something like that. I'm going to make this bolt on. So, but I'll first, I'll probably tack weld it to it so it doesn't move. Um, not exactly. Probably tack that, tack this, tack that, and then it should hold enough to get the angle bar down here. So it's coming together. Uh, didn't wasn't sure what I was gonna do right here, but uh, usually I design when I go, so it ends up how it is and surprises me sometimes. I'm still in part from this one. Uh, this one's just going to be on hold for now. Uh, this one's more important right now. Uh, especially if I can sell them. But this one is, it's just getting, it's, I'm speechless. <laughs> it's going to be bad. Uh, it's already looking good. Got the shock mounts done. Well, tacked into place. I still got to add some pieces here. In here, and there's some gussets here. Uh, it's gonna be pretty strong, so yeah. I'm still in the parts, I'm taking the wheels right now, and I'll probably take those off just and put this on the ground for a little mock up. And still haven't ordered some heim joints yet either, so uh, I'm gonna do that soon. I'm trying to message barnsfulldrive.com. See if they can get me some Heim joints. Uh, seems like their price is pretty, pretty fair. Um, but that's it for this video. Uh, like I said, I wanted to get the swing arm done and the seat and the shock. I'm still going to add some gusseting and stuff to stuff, to parts of it right here. Um, probably like a book right here. I won't know till I get to it, but I want to make it a roller first, so yeah. 
Like and subscribe and tell your friends. Go create something. Uh oh. Uh, I just messed up. Not really. I had to cut those off because uh, I had to fit those wheels. But I want to do some removable ones anyways out of three quarter. I want to do the sides of this real redo them. But here's this on the ground mocked up pretty nicely I it's about the wheelbase it's gonna be oh, it's turning out nice so it's got a lot of stuff left but it's gonna be bad so keep watching